why were you successful when others weren't? What is it about the technologies you looked at, the people you chose to partner with, the approach you took in building those companies that really allowed you to separate out from, from the norm? Yeah, I think it's all of the above, but I think m most importantly, it's, it's asking the question of what problem are you solving? There's so many assets that came about by circumstance, or an accident almost, or, or people being very passionate about what, they, what their technology is. That's not the question. The question is, what is this industry trying to accomplish as a whole? And you just look at where big pharma is, right? Very, very rich cash flow. I mean, the top 11 pharma companies over the next couple of years will have an annual free cash flow of $55 billion a year. But at the same time, they're saying 30% of their pipeline is going to be biologics. And you just simply ask yourself the question, how are they going to get there? And you look at what technologies they have, and you realize it's not looking that good. So they can either acquire themselves out of that hole, or they can bring technologies in-house. And so what we do is we think in advance of what they're going to need. And then we try to build a premier offering with the best people in that space, and then good things tend to happen. 